Time now for the executive edge. We're going to start with some stocks on the move this morning. Shares of Mattel are trading higher. The toy maker posted a fourth quarter profit of 11 cents a share. Revenue missed expectations and sales in North America decreased by 1% because of a decline in infant, toddler and preschool toys. Also a decline in, t in sales of dolls as well. The CEO of Mattel is going to be joining Jim Cramer in an exclusive interview tonight on Mad Money. That's coming up at 6 p.m. Eastern time. Shares of Yelp. Sharply lower. Fourth quarter earnings at 24 cents a share missed estimates by two cents. Revenue also fell short. Company uh, announcing an additional $250 million uh, share buyback, though, uh, and a new CFO, Andrew. Yes. And a viral video, I want to know what everybody thinks of this, is stirring up a heated debate on social media. Video depicts a tall man seated in the last row of an airplane and the woman in front of him who decided to recline her seat. So in response, the man begins... Methodically, I don't know if methodically is the word I'd use, but yeah, he's punching doing it repetitively, the back kind of, of boom, her boom, boom. seat. Uh, people are divided, with some arguing the plane leg room has decreased over the last few years, so reclining is inconsiderate, and others saying if she bought the seat, she has the right to recline. I am in the camp that he shouldn't be punching the back of the seat. No, that's Basically, true. that's the problem. I don't even think there's much of a Look, I get it. I here. get it when you're in that last it's seat terrible. and you can't lean back. That's a terrible seat. Right. I kind of blame the airlines for Look, setting right, it up that way. You gotta, something's got to be seriously wrong with you if you sit there and there's some lady in front of you and you keep hitting the seat like that. Right. There's something seriously wrong with that guy. Seriously. Right? Some, I mean, I think this is terrible. You know, I don't wanna, I'm not advocating sure. violence, but someone needed to... to Right. Tell that guy stop what to do. If you're if you're and if he doesn't do it, then, you know, you need to enforce. Right. What OK, you're... having said that, let's just let's take the punching out of it for a second, though, because mm -hmm. this is what I think people are debating. What do you think it should she have put her seat back in or could could if he well, said why to they her have the button on it? He, he could have said to her, can you sit up a little bit? Because yes. I don't have a right to mind, in which is, case she should have lifted and then up if a little she bit. doesn't, then what? Then uh, take then it up somewhere else. But again, this but, is like the airlines for cramming you into right. the seats where they have been shrinking inches and inches every year off right. of this to try and cram more people in. And then people say, oh, they want the cheap way, tickets. The, the way I remember it, you're sitting there and when the person moves back, it doesn't do any, it doesn't come close to my legs. It may be a little bit closer to look, where I be, am, but... It, he, had his, he had his tray table down, and it yeah. looked like it was right up yeah, against the, him. What happens is the tray going, table comes, it comes, comes, comes back you. as you... See, look, it's like right up against him, which who, I guess... Those road warriors out there who do a lot of work, either on a laptop or an iPad, it makes it a lot harder but to But what he's doing done. is unacceptable. No, it's I agree completely with unacceptable. Okay, so now, what would you do to him? Should he gotten carried off the plane? I don't know. Okay, what? can we resolve things a little more civilly? Can we just well, say, hey, I'm sorry. Kind of like the chair up a little. between we... Mayor Mike and President Trump, resolve <laughs> things more civilly and don't don't yeah. get in the muck with each other. I don't know if that's going to happen in today's society. Now, I don't know what I would have done with that. You, you don't want to, you can get arrested for anything, can't you? The slightest, you if you touch someone, you can get Absolutely. arrested. I don't know what I would have done. I mean, it would have been, I wouldn't have just, I don't know. I don't, I don't want to think about it because it gets me sort of... Uh, nervous? Yeah, it makes me nervous. I'm getting anxious. Getting I mean, anxious. I don't want to get anxious on a Friday, on Valentine's, <laughs> on Valentine's Day. Day. Wait till tonight when okay. I, you know, then I'll get a little bit anxious. Let us know uh, what Did you I think? do everything right? Did I, you know... Tweet at us. Oh. Uh, have all the flowers. What you would do and, uh, and if then, you were sitting in that back seat. <laughs> and if you were sitting in the seat that she was sitting in, would have you reclined back? By the way, sometimes... You, you say something to the person in front of you, you say, hey, or, and then they don't. I like right. that you pretend that, that you don't. know what goes on in coach and have the slightest idea. I know. I do. I do. I like I that you. I in coach on Monday. I, I do like that you pretend. I, I know all yeah, about I'm it. Yeah, sure you do. Now, mm -hmm. kids there in first are. class, yeah. that's a debate worth having. <laughs> right. We can talk about that all day long, as many of our viewers Andrew know. Wants everyone to be we haven't had that debate in a while, uh, but we will.